Hello and welcome to the Graphicalize channel. Today, we're gonna do a beginner's class and we start with your foot bar down. I'm using a red spring and a yellow. If you don't have a yellow, you can use just a fine spring. And we're gonna lie down in your back. So roll on your side, lie down in your back, and we're gonna start with your hands on your mat. Your head is down. You can figure out if you need a headrest up or down. If your chin is not parallel to the ground, it's too lifted. You can lift a little bit headrest, but if you can keep your chin parallel to the ground, it's better to put your headrest down. Hands on your side, collar wide, let's start just with your breathing. Just inhale through your nose, open your ribs sideways, expand your ribs, exhale, open your mouth, and pull your belly in, engaging your core. Just inhale through your nose, open your ribs. Now try to send a little more air to your back ribs without moving your back. Just inhale through your nose. Exhale, open your mouth. Let the air go out without resistance and start pulling your belly in when you're breathing out. Inhaling through your nose. Exhaling through your mouth. One more time, inhaling through your nose. Exhaling through your mouth. We're gonna start moving your pelvis. So imagine you have a plate of water in your belly, and we're gonna send that plate of water, that water to your head. So round your back and place your lower spine on the mat. Now we're gonna lift that lower spine, you're gonna arch your lower spine, and we're gonna do, uh, you're gonna send that water to your feet. Inhale through your nose, water to your head, exhale, water to your feet. So you're moving just your pelvis, breathe in, exhale out, two more, in, and out, one more time, in, and out. Now we're going to start slowly going to your bridge position. So you're going to lift your hip up, inhale through your nose, exhale, roll down, one vertebra at a time. You take your bones down, inhale through your nose, round your back, lift your hip. So your knees, hip, and chest will be same line. Inhale, Exhale, roll down, slowly put one vertebra down at a time. If the carrot is moving a little, no worries. Exhale, round, lift your hip, trying to keep that carrot still. So using your hamstring to hold it still. Exhale, roll down, one vertebra at a time. Last one, inhale, exhale, roll up. Inhale through your nose, exhale, roll down one vertebra at a time. Just inhale here and we're going to bring your right leg toward your chest. Bring it, so close and stretch your opposite leg. Reach out, collarbone wide. You're really squeezing that knee toward your chest. Hold for five, four, three, two and one. Now place your hands under your quad, under your knee, and we're going to stretch that leg towards the ceiling. Inhale, bend your knee. Exhale, stretch out. Inhale, bend. Exhale, out. Inhale, bend. Exhale, out. One more time. You're going to hold that leg straight as much as possible and just move your foot. Point and flex. Point and flex, point and flex, one more point, flex, bend your knee again. Now we're going to hold your knee with your opposite hand, bringing that knee toward your opposite shoulder, keeping your tailbone down. You're going to feel a little stretch in your hip, in your butt. Hold for five, four, three, two, and one. In all of these movements, it's good for your hip joint. Now bring the other leg, squeeze toward your chest, bring that knee, inhale through your nose, hold for five, four, three, 
two, and one. Place your hands under your knee, and we're gonna strike that leg towards the ceiling. And bend your knee again. Exhale, stretch, and bend. Stretch, bend one more time, stretch. Now we're gonna hold this leg straight, and we're gonna move just your foot. Do point and heel. Point, relax your shoulders, breathing in, breathing out. Great, bend that knee and hold with your opposite hand, keeping your tailbone down. Bring that knee toward your opposite shoulder. Holding for five, four, three, two, and one. Really good. We're gonna place your legs bent, and we're gonna send both arms toward the ceiling. Just move your shoulder blades. Inhale, exhale, put your shoulder blades back on the mat. Inhale, we open your shoulder blades. Exhale, lower down. Your arms are straight. It's just your shoulder blades opening and closing. Just inhale, keeping your chin in, parallel to the ground. Exhale, open your mouth. One more time, inhale. And exhale, hold here. And we're gonna bring one leg tabletop and the other leg tabletop. Hold here. Now open just a little both arms and legs. And bring it in. Inhaling through your nose. Exhaling through your mouth. Inhale. Exhale four. And go for five. Exhale six. Seven. Breathe out. Eight. Just open a little. Nine. Now hold your arms and legs toward the ceiling. Now you're going to open just a little your right arm sideways and your left leg. Control. Inhale. So remember, you have a plate of water in your belly and you cannot drop that water to anywhere. Okay? So you're keeping your spine stable and just moving your legs and arms. Opposite arm and legs. Inhale. Exhale. And go for five, exhale, four, and three, exhale, two, and one. Keep your legs tabletop, lower little your arms right beside your head. Lift your head and chest if you can, and we're going to hold your legs, squeeze it together. Now, inhale, pump your arms. Inhale, one, two, three, four, five. Exhale, one, two, three, four, five. Inhaling in five counts. Exhaling in five counts and pumping your arms. Try to lift a little more your head and chest, looking toward your knees. You have a space between your chin and your chest. Don't touch your chin and your chest, looking forward. Inhale, one, two, three, four, five. Exhale, one, two, three, four, five. Inhale, one, two, three, four, five. Exhale, one, two, three, four, five. Inhale, one, two, three, four, five. Exhale, one, two, three, four, five. Inhale, one, two, three, four, five. Exhale, one, two, three, four. Reach out, lower your head, lower your arms, and lower your legs. Great, great. Knees toward the ceiling. Just open a little your legs sideways. Inhale, bring back center. Exhale, go through your four and bring your knees center. Exhale, go for three. Exhale, four. One more. And great. Now we're going to grab your handles. Oops, I forgot to put my handles back here. Let me grab it. Good, good. Sitting at the edge, lying down on your side, rolling back to the reformer. Grab your handles, send your arms towards the ceiling. Your hands are going to be right above your shoulders. You're going to bring one leg tabletop through your core. So you need to have tension here in your arms. You're holding the straps, okay? It's not like this way, relax. You have tension, and we're going to put your leg down. Inhale, you're going to bring the other leg to the top. Exhale, lower down. So you have a little tension in your arms. Inhaling through your nose, and pay attention in 
your core, making sure your belly button is not coming up when you're lifting your legs. Just inhale, exhale, breathe out, shoulders down, inhale, exhale. Now we're going to hold a little your legs in here. So I'm going to bring one leg tabletop, hold your arms, and bring the other leg tabletop. Now lower one leg and lower the other leg. So you can bring your right leg tabletop, bring your left leg tabletop, lower your right leg, now your left leg. Let's try the opposite side. Bring your left leg tabletop, right leg tabletop, left leg down, right leg down, right leg up, left leg up, right leg down, left leg down, left leg up, right leg up, left leg down, right leg down. Now we're going to hold both legs in the air. Belly in, column wide, legs together. Just inhale here, exhale and lower your arms. Inhale, bring your arms up to the ceiling, exhale, lower. Belly in, column wide, three. Inhale through your nose, exhale, open your mouth for four. Exhale, five. Belly in, six. Exhale. Seven and go for eight. Exhale nine. One more. Bring your arms towards the ceiling. Hold your hands right above your shoulder. Lower one leg and lower the other leg. Great. You're gonna place your elbows 90 degrees. Your collarbone will need to be wide. You're putting pressure in that strap. And we're gonna bring one leg tabletop and lower down. The other leg, tabletop, lower down everything through your core. Three, exhale, four, collarbone wide. You have some pressure here in your arms. You're feeling your arms working and also your core. You're bringing your legs through your core, not through your hip flexor. Two, and one. Now you're going to bring your right leg, tabletop, hold, left leg, tabletop, Lower your right leg, lower your left leg. Bring your left leg tabletop, right leg tabletop. Lower your left leg, lower your right leg. Bring your right leg tabletop, left leg tabletop. Right leg down, left leg down. Bring your left leg tabletop, right leg tabletop. Left leg down, right leg down. Now we're gonna bring both legs and we're gonna stay with your legs up. Call the bone wide. Now try to stretch your arms and bend 90 degrees. Remember, you're not touching your elbows on the ground and you're keeping that collarbone wide all the time. Inhaling, squeezing your legs, pulling your belly in. Exhale, four, and go to five. Breathing in, breathing out. Long breath is more important. Two, and one really good. Hold your arms straight out. We're gonna lift your arms towards the ceiling. We're gonna lower one leg and lower the other leg. Hold your arms towards the ceiling. Round your back a little. And we're gonna lift your hip up in a bridge position. Remember, if you're doing bridge, you need to put your headrest down. Roll your spine down. One vertebra at a time. Tailbone reach the ground. Round your back. Go up to your bridge position, inhale through your nose, exhale through your mouth, slowly rolling down one word of the time, one more time. We're going to hold up, we're going to sink just a little your arms sideways and bring it up to the ceiling. Exhale sideways and go two, exhale three, and go four. Exhale, five, one more, arms up, and roll your spine down, one vertebra at a time. Great. Now, holding your arms straight up to the ceiling, you're going to bring one leg tabletop and the other leg tabletop. Hold through your core. We're going to do small circles out and around, belly in. Go for one, exhale, two, and go for three, exhale, four, and five, six, 
seven, exhale, eight, nine, ten, bring your arms up, lower one leg, lower the other leg, just give yourself a break, inhale through your nose, exhale, bring one leg, tabletop, bring the other leg, tabletop, open out and around and go opposite direction, exhale, two, and go to three, Exhale, four, belly and five, six, seven, exhale, eight, nine, one more. Reach out, bring your arms towards the ceiling, lower one leg, lower the other leg. Now you can put your straps back. Good, good. We're going to roll on your side. Press that headrest and seat at the edge of the carriage. We're going to place that foot arm up. And you can use two springs, maybe one and a half, maybe three springs, give you a little more advanced. I like to put your pillow here on a headrest, but if you don't have it, put your headrest up. And we're going to lie down on your side. You're going to place your top foot at the edge of the foot bar and stretch your other leg all the way out. Relax your head on the headrest and lift your lower leg. We're going to press the carriage out so your knee needs to be aligned with your second toe, okay? Relax your neck and press out through your heel. Go for three. Exhale, four. Send your hip away. Five, six, seven, exhale, eight, press out, and we're going to hold halfway down. If you're tired, you can return everything. If you're good here, hold halfway, and we're going to do circles with your lower leg. Go for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and reverse, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're going to hold this leg in the air and press again, up and down, one, exhale, two, and go for three, Exhale, four, knee aligned with your second toe. Don't allow your knee to drop. Need to be aligned with your foot. Using your heel to press out. Two, and one. Bring the carriage all the way in. And you're going to bring both legs a little more forward. Send your hip away. Keep your head relaxed here on the headrest. And we're going to lift that top leg and lower down. Exhale, go for two. And go for three, exhale, four, five, six, and seven, exhale, eight, nine, and really good. Now we're going to try to grab that ankle, send your knee back to stretch your hip. Hold for five, four, three, two, and one. Really good. We're going to lie down on the other side. Turn around. Send your hip more back. Your top foot at the edge of your foot bar. Stretch your lower leg and rest your head in your head rest. Pressing your hip away and stretching the leg. Pressing that foot bar. Remember, you cannot lock your knee. Press out. Inhaling through your nose. Exhaling through your mouth. Go four. Exhale, five. One knee more above the other one. And seven. Exhale, eight. Nine. You can hold halfway down. If it's hard, you can return everything. And we're going to do circles with your lower leg. Go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 
three, two, one, and reverse. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You can press all the way out again and bring it in. But remember that you need to be fluid like you're riding a bicycle. You cannot lock your knee up and down. Four, exhale, five, six, seven, and eight, exhale, nine, one more, press out and bring it all the way down. We're going to put your knees together, sending your hip away, your legs a little more forward, up that foot bar, and we're going to just lift your leg, hip distance apart, and lower down. And go for two, exhale, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, nine, and really good. We're going to try to grab your ankle, same with your knee back, open your chest, leg stretch your quad, chest, hold for five, four, three, two, and one. Really good. Press the headrest and we're going to sit. We're going to use two red springs for, I think two red springs will be good, just two springs. And we're going to sit at the edge of the couch. Okay? Your hands are going to be here at the edge. Your feet are going to be down or you can also place your feet more up. And we're going to hold it here, round your back just a little. Exhale, stretch your leg out and bring it back in. Exhale, stretch out and bring it in. Rounding your back, your hands down and go for three. Exhale, four. One more time and go five. Come back. We're going to place your hands right beside your headrest. Open your chest, okay? Open, open that collarbone. And we're going to press out for one. Exhale, two. And go for three. Exhale, four. And five. Really good. Now bring your arms all the way forward, trying to keep your spine straight and press out. One. Exhale, two, and three, exhale, four, and five. Good job. Put your hands here on the foot bar. Send your chest up to the ceiling. Open that collarbone and hold for five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Feet on the ground. We're going to use one loop spring. If you don't have good flexibility in your hip, you can also use a small box to sit here. You can sit on that small box. If you don't have it, you can cross your leg. We're going to place that part here of your hand on the foot bar. Keeping your shoulder down, you need to be really close to the foot bar. Okay, and we're going to press the carriage out, keeping your shoulder down. And go for two. Your shoulders down all the time. Three. Exhale, four. And go, five. Belly in, six. Seven. Exhale, eight. Nine. Good, hold your arms straight out. Lift your opposite arm, reach up to the ceiling. Seat tall, spine totally straight. Now we go over, just a little, reaching a little more, stretching the side of your body, keeping your shoulder down, reach, reach, reach. Come back center and bang your elbow, keeping that arm toward the ceiling. Press out, shoulder down, reach, 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 reach up. Go over, and just a little stretch in the side of your body. Bring that arm up toward the ceiling, keeping your shoulder down, bang your elbow. One more time, stretch out, straight up, 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 and go over just a little, stretching, stretching. 
Send your arm up, up, up to the ceiling and bend your elbow. Let's do other side. Turn around. If you need to use a bar, grab it here. You can sit above that small box. Cross your legs. Open your chest. And you're going to place your hand a little more forward using the side of your hand to press out. Remember that you need to be really close to that foot bar and your shoulder needs to be down. So press out and bend your elbow. And go for two. Exhale, three. And go four. Belly in. Five. Exhale, six. And seven. Exhale, eight. Nine. Hold that arm straight out. Keep your shoulder down. Send your arm up to the ceiling. The other shoulder is also down. We're going to bring that arm above your head and reach and go just a little over to stretch the side of your body. Looking forward, open your chest. Inhale through your nose. Exhale, send your arm up to the ceiling and bend your elbow to return. Exhale, press out, shoulder down. Go over, over. Looking forward, open your chest, bring your arm up to the ceiling and bend your elbow one more time. Exhale, press out, shoulder down, go over, over, inhale, exhale, send your arm up to the ceiling, bend your elbow and lower your arm. Great. We're going to put that foot bar a little more down. Right here, hold it on down. And we're going to use one red and one yellow spring, maybe just a red for you. And we're going to sit on the foot bar. Sit here at the edge, so your sit bones need to be a little more forward. Your sit bones are not that. A little more forward than the foot bar. Your heel is going to be at the edge of your, of the edge of the carriage. Your spine needs to be straight. Hands here on the foot bar, and we're going to stretch your leg out and bring the carriage until you need be in 90 degrees. Exhale, stretch out and bring it in. And go for three. Sitting tall, four. Exhale, five. So you're pressing out through your heel. Seven. Exhale, eight. Nine. Great, we're gonna hold the carriage halfway in, stay there, hold for five, four, three, two, one. Two small pulses, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring the carriage in. Good, let's switch to the other side. Turn around. You're going to sit at the edge of that foot bar. Your sit bones need to be forward, okay? Not behind that foot bar, more forward. And your heel in front of the edge of that carriage. And we're going to press the carriage out. You can adjust that foot. Knee align with your second toe. Bring the carriage in until 90 degrees. And press out. One. Exhale to your belly in. Three, four, don't lock your knees. Move. And six, seven, exhale, eight, nine. We're going to hold the carriage halfway in. Stay for five, four, three, two, one. Small pulses. Ten, nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring the carriage all the way in. Good, good. Step down. And let's put that foot bar down again. All the way down. You can push your carriage with some pads if it's not comfortable for your knees. Place your hands more forward on the frame. You're going to keep your shoulder blades wide and your body's going to be in a quadruped position. Really important to sock your elbows. Now, round your back, send your head down, and your tail will come down. Exhale, lift your head, and your tail will come Stay Chest up, head up, tail will come up. Now, round your back, keep your shoulder blades wide all the time. Pull your belly in. Lift your head. And you're going to move 
One more time. You're going to round your back, head down, tailbone down. Lift just a little your head and your table. Put your knees together, shoulder blades wide. You're going to just stretch your right leg back. Hold five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it in. Shoulder blades wide. If you're not feeling safe here, you just stretch a little your back. Don't keep that foot up. If you're feeling good, you can stretch your other leg out. Hip square, hold for five, four, three, two, one. Shoulder blades wide. Elbows soft. Don't lock your elbows. Stretch your right leg out. Hold for five, four, three, two, one. Bring it in. You're going to switch. Stretch your other leg out and hold for five. Four, three, two, and one. Bring it in. Now place your heels right in front of your shoulder rest. Your legs keep distance apart. Soft your, your elbows. We have it here a red and a yellow spring. Okay? If you need to take the yellow off, oh, that's fine. We're going to press the carriage out through your arms. So press out and bring it in. Shoulder blades right. Go two. And again, three, exhale, four, go five, six, just your arms move, seven, exhale, eight, nine, one more, great, bring the carriage in, place your feet inside the headrest, same arms forward, you want to just stretch your hip, your back, inhaling through your nose, your arms, exhale through your mouth, and return to the same position, elbows wide, hips deep, right in front of your shoulder rest. Now we're going to press just a little bit carriage back through your arms, hold it. Now we're going to move just your legs, but can you see that my hips not moving? my legs, so I'm not dropping my hip. Inhaling, just let it move back and forward. And go to three shoulder blades wide. Exhale, four. And go five. Now in six. Shoulder blades wide, seven. And eight. Exhale, nine. And great. Now place your feet in. Stretch your arms forward. Inhaling through your nose. Exhaling through your mouth. And just step down for me. And let's grab your box. Long box. We're going to place it here, right at the on at the edge of our shoulder rest, low box, and I'm going to take my foot bar one click down, so it's not all the way up, it's more lower, and we can use just one spring, just one right spring, so you can lie down on your belly, facing the foot bar, the legs will be together, and your hands will be on the foot bar. Don't, I don't want to see your knees hyperextended with your legs this way. You need to lift a little your leg and pull your belly in. Your chin is in, shoulders down. Just press your hair out, elbows facing the ground, and bend. If you're feeling that slide, you can put one more yellow or maybe one blue, okay? But you cannot lift your shoulders. The movement needs to be just here in your elbows, bending and stretching, and go five. Exhale, four, three. Your legs are together. Squeeze. Sometimes I feel more in my legs than in my arms. Sometimes not. Always. Okay, now you just need to keep one spring, one rest. Press all the way out. Hold this way. You're going to bring your shoulders down. And we're going to lift just a little of your shoulders. So pay attention just to your shoulders. You're not lifting your head and chest is not extension. You're just moving your shoulders up and down. Inhaling through your nose, bring your shoulders to your ears. Exhale, swing your shoulders to your feet. Two more. Last one. Now 
arms, you bring your shoulders down. You're gonna lift just a little of your head and chest. Looking forward, belly in, and lower down. Exhale, pull your belly in, shoulders down. Extending just a little of your upper back. Inhale through your nose. Exhale, reach up. And lower down, belly in. Exhale, lift. One, two, three, and lower down. Two more. Exhale, you lift. One, two, three, and lower down. Last one. One, two, three, and lower down. Bang your elbows. Step down slowly. And we're going to use just one boot spring. Just one boot. Take out the leg. It's a half spring now. And we're going to ride on a horse. So you need to sit in your box. Your butt is going to be a little more forward. One hand forward at the edge of the box. We're going to go down to grab your handles. Careful to grab your handles. And we're going to bend your arms. And we're going to start with your arms in 90 degrees. Call a little wide. Just hold your belly and just stretch your arms forward. Careful to not open your shoulder blades, okay? Not open too much. You're not moving your shoulder blades. You're keeping still, just moving your arms. And your elbows not coming all the way back. You stop here, right side of your body, and stretch forward. Inhale and bend your elbows. Exhale, stretch forward. Go to. Exhale, reach out three, and belly in four. Exhale, five, go six, and seven. Exhale, eight, nine. We're gonna hold your arms straight forward. Stay there, hold for five, four, three, two, one, bend your elbows and relax a little, send your hands down. Hands down, open the chest a little, send your arms out and around, hold for five, four, three, two, one. Bring it in again, bend your elbows, call up on one, just to be here, we're working out. Elbows glue in your body. We're going to send just a little of your arms sideways and bring it in, just a little. Open sideways, elbows glue. Two, exhale, three, belly in, four, exhale, five, and six, seven, exhale, eight, nine, one more. Send your arms down, hold open, just hold five, four, Three, two, one. Bring it in. Elbows bent, 90 degrees. You're going to stretch your arms forward and we're going to do five circles. Five, four, exhale, three. Reaching out, two, one. Small circles and reverse. Five, exhale, four, three, two, and one. Reach out. Bend your elbows one more time. And stretch your arms back slowly. You're going to put that handles back slowly, carefully. And move one leg and the other one. And let's place that box back. Good, good. Now we can sit at the edge of your carriage. You can put one red to keep it still red and blue. And we're going to try to cross your right leg above your left leg and press that knee away. And hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Last switch. Other leg. Over, send that knee down, stretching your back, and hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Foot on the ground, shoulders down, hand in your head, here 
to your shoulder, relax your shoulder. And hold for five, four, three, two. Look under your arm, send your chin just a little more to your chest. Stretch your neck and hold five. Be gentle, four, three, two, one. Bring your head back, we're gonna switch. Hand in your head, hand to your shoulders, stretch and hold five, four, three, two, one. Look under your arms, send your chin to your chest. Hold five, four, three, two, one. Bring it back. Now bring just your shoulders to your ears. Exhale, slide your shoulders down. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. One more time, bring your shoulders to your ears. Slide them down, and that is your class. Thank you for joining me today. I hope to see you soon in our virtual classes or in studio. God bless you.